Welcome back to another video. Beautiful, beautiful evening out here in dirty Jersey. Fall weather, leaves are turning. My favorite time of the year to ride is probably, probably the fall time, man. It's just the whole scenery, the weather, it's perfect. Anyways, I wanted to make a video today talking about why I do YouTube. And the reason why I decided to do this video today is for a deep reason, which I'm gonna leave towards the end of the video. So within the video, we're gonna talk about how I started, why I do it, the reasons why I do it, and then we'll leave that that last part towards the end because it's a it's a it's a very deep message and reasoning why I, I I decided to do this video today the way I'm doing it right now. Um, so just just tune in. Um, so for those of you guys who have been following me for some time right now, you guys have known my journey. But if for those of you that do not know, I basically started the whole uh, motorcycle content back in the fall time of 2018. I started off with an iron. Prior to that, I was doing random vlogs. I would do videos with my family, do just random stuff. Uh, just the most randomest videos just just because um, and then around the time when I decided to purchase the 883 during that time I was watching a lot of Harley content online on YouTube I was watching the people who was mainly watching a lot were Blockhead, Bike and Bird back then, SRK Cycles I was watching back then those were probably the three main people who I was watching and just getting my uh my source is from for the most part um so when i i bought the bike i bought the bike because i wanted to buy my first bike uh, i wanted it to be a harley davidson obviously i didn't intend to buy the bike to with, with the intentions of hey i'm gonna make a channel just around this because obviously if you go back to my uh my content from even 2012 i used to do sneaker reviews that's what i used to do i used to do sneaker reviews and the most subscribers i had back then we're like 2,000, 3,000 subscribers. And then I stopped doing YouTube for like five years. And then in 17 is when I started again, just randomly just doing random stuff. Like I said, with my family and just the most random videos. Anyways, fast forward, I buy the bike. I did the video not knowing that, hey, I'm gonna make content around motorcycles. And I just did it because, hey, I bought a bike and I, I wanna show you guys. I was, what I was doing was just sharing a piece of my life with everybody. The same way people do with Facebook or with Instagram or Snapchat, whatever the case may be, whatever platform you're using. You know how we all upload a picture here and there to show people, hey, this is what I'm doing right now. That's what I was doing with the videos. I'm like, hey, I'm doing this today or I'm doing that. That's how it all started. I posted my first video and I, uh, I got an alarming reaction because I was like, whoa, like there's a lot of people watching this. Okay, cool made another video another video and, and it kind of caught on right so out of nowhere it became a, a channel that focused on random vlogs mainly focusing around my 883 a whole year passes by i buy the bike that kind of made the channel what it is today which is the low rider s back in 2019 um september of 2019 i remember i bought the 2020 low rider s back then the newer models came out in the, in the in the summertime august september is when all the models came out for the pre for the next year bought the low rider s um that helped me shape the channel into what it is today um it it exposed me to new elements i learned so much even myself working on that bike i made so many mistakes as well on camera off camera uh which you guys know um i'm very organic with myself i love to show that if there's one thing about me is that i love to show when i'm wrong about something and i admit it because if a lot of content creators for the most part put this whole persona that they're kind of perfect and they know everything and they're a know-it-all and it, it, no it's not like that um you, you you can't put on a persona that you're perfect and half of the time you don't know what the hell you're talking about or you're reading off a script or you're reading off a pamphlet like doesn't work that way i love to show 
I love to make errors. I learn from my errors that, that that's in my persona. I love to learn and work from my errors. And like I said, I've, I've shown that on camera. I'm not uh, ashamed of it, you know, whatever. Um, fast forward later on, I got the Dyna, did content with that for a while. Uh, traded the Dyna for the Rogue Glide, which right now is where we're at with the channel. Uh, during that time, I bought an FXR, had it for a little while, got rid of it. Um, but this is the only bike on the channel right now, which is the Rogue Glide. I took it from doing the Lord Rider S content to doing bagger content, which it has changed the channel drastically. Um, these bikes are so different in every way, and it's it's awesome um anyway so let, let, let's get into all the reasons why i do youtube for you guys that's always fun um why do i do youtube i do it for several reasons a it is my hobby my hobby became something that i love doing something that you guys enjoy watching my hobby became uh, a source of income my hobby became and helped me grow into into this persona this marvel kid 87 persona which you guys all know me as um if there's one thing about me if for those of you guys who don't know me and for those of you guys who have seen my content and then met me a person there's only one thing you get that, that, that I'm sure everyone can agree on is that it's the same person that you see on camera is the same person that you're gonna see him that you're gonna meet in person. I, I I don't change. I'm not like other people where I put on this persona and I put on this act and and then I'm I'm someone else behind the scenes. I'm I'm trust me. This is what you get in person. Everything I do is organic. Um. So this this is my hobby. And I love doing it. I, I love sharing my experience with you guys. I love doing reviews. The reason why is because when I'm shopping for a product, or even back then before I knew about so many uh, different products, uh, and I didn't know much about bikes. I knew a few things. But even prior to that, when I used to watch content, I didn't get all the answers that I was looking for. That and that's why one of the main reasons why I, I kind of I, I kept going with the videos was because I was always super annoyed when I was on YouTube looking for something. Whoever was making a video wasn't detailed enough or didn't do the content in a way for me to learn or grasp onto it quickly. So that's one thing that stuck with me later on when I started doing my videos. That's uh, that was like my little formula. I started doing content for newer riders. So if you look at a lot of my content, a lot of my older content, most of my content is it revolves around newer riders or people who, who are getting into riding. Um, and, and I like to explain things in that type of form. I like to explain things in a way where even if you know it all, I'm still going to explain it to you like if you don't know anything, if that makes any sense. Um, so... That's one of the reasons why why I do this is to help out the community, help out newer riders. Um, it's my hobby. I also love doing this because it it, it has opened. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, it has opened a lot of doors for me. I've, I've got the opportunity to work with a lot of different companies. Um, the biggest company of all <laughs> that I've worked with is you know has to be Harley Davidson. Uh, Indian motorcycle. The, the, this channel revolves mainly around Harley Davidson, as we know, but there is a lot of Indian content. Um, I'm, I'm a big fan of Indian, the company. I love what they're doing right now. Um, and th th there, there will be more Indian content coming down the pipeline, just FYI. We got a lot of stuff planned right now. Um, I've, I've got to work with a lot of, you know, uh, companies who, who, who make products. I've got to work with sponsors and this and that it's it's awesome that that's like the cool part of it but th there's also a lot of and this is going to sound cliche uh but but there has been a lot of sweat hard work and tears that i've i've put in this in the last few years since 2018 a lot of work and i mean my channel is nowhere near where i want it to be right um 
but it, it's definitely made an impact in the industry. Um, and I don't give myself enough credit. My friends do that for me. My wife is a big supporter. A lot of you guys are big supporters and you guys kind of remind me of what I'm doing, why I'm doing this. And I, I thank you for that. Um, but I, I don't give myself enough credit. So yes, right now we're at we're reaching almost 32,000 subscribers. Obviously, we're gonna keep working, 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 working uh, to make it grow. I don't do this for the fame because I, I, even though I'm I'm like a super extrovert, I I don't care about being known. I don't care about the attention. You know, I I, I do this because it's my passion. I, and everything I do is very organic. And that's not even with my channel. That's with everything. I, I feel like that. That's just part of my lifestyle, my culture. Is that I like. I love to do things organic. So I don't script my videos. Um, some people do that, and that that's awesome. That's great. I, I just can't. I can't. I can't read off a script. Um, I need to do everything organic. So once those cameras turn on, whether I'm doing a face to face with you guys, uh, whether I'm doing this right now. This is all from the top of my dome. There's sometimes where we go really deep into videos, talking about stuff, that's all from my head. And I like to speak with emotion. I like to speak with my feelings. I like to speak with uh, just an, an, organic, an organic feeling of everything. Everything and anything. Um, but th that, that's just my style, you know? That doesn't work for everybody. Some people, they need to do a script, you know? Some people need to read off something. Some people write an essay and, and, and that, that, that's how they do their stuff. And it's cool. If that works for you, that's, that's awesome. Now, we're about to get into the reason why I really wanted to do this video, but I just want to point out everything real quick. The reason why I do this, once again, is because it's a hobby. I love it. I enjoy it. I love to help you guys learn new things. I love to be a part of the culture. Um, and I like to put my two cents into everything, as you guys know. I like to give my opinion on everything. And that's why. So, anyways, last week, I come home, had a long, long day at work. And, and this is when I realized, this is one of the reasons why I do YouTube. So, I had a long day at work, right? You know, we have those long days where you just want to go home. You don't want to do anything else. You just want to go home and uh, crack a beer or just watch something that's going to make you laugh. That's what I wanted to do that day. That day I was like, you know, I want to go home. I just want to watch something on YouTube because I watch YouTube most mainly. I don't really watch TV. I don't watch anything else, right? It's all YouTube that I watch. So, go on and I can't find anything. And we all know right now with what's whatever's going on in the Middle East, which I'm not going to get into it. I'm not going to get uh, too political with this. Um... <clears throat> I went on YouTube and that's all I saw on my platform. And I kept scrolling and scrolling and scrolling. I'm like, all right, I, I, I already seen what's going on. I know what's going on. I, I, I'm actually a big history buff. So that's a fun fact if you didn't know that about me. I'm a huge history buff. So I know a lot about the history of what's been going on right now, what's been going on for thousands of years in that area of the world. Um, so I, I don't need all the information bombarded at me like the way it was. And I couldn't find anything. And I'm like, yo, like, I, I really just want to be entertained right now. That's all I want. I want to laugh. I want to watch something funny. I want to learn something new. And no, I wasn't getting that. And then I'm like, I'm a content creator. And I love to, if most of my videos, are, you know, I, 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 it's a lot of comedy in it, right? I, I try to make it very comical for you guys. I love to make people laugh, right? So... I, I address things in that form of way. Um, and that day, that, that's what I wanted to get, and I wasn't getting that. And then I was thinking, I'm like, this is why I, I do my stuff. I, I do my stuff because for those seven minutes, however long the video is going to be, for those seven minutes, for those 10 minutes, for those 15 minutes that you are watching one of my videos, for those seven minutes, you are free from the rest of your life. For those seven or 15 minutes, you're captivated into whatever I'm creating for you to watch. Whether I'm entertaining you with laughs, whether I'm entertaining you with some Harley Davidson news, with uh, an install video, with a review video, whatever it is. But for those few minutes, you forget about whatever's going on in your personal life, whether it's bad or good, 
Maybe you're going through a bad day. Maybe you're going through a bad breakup. Maybe you're you're going through a loss of somebody, whatever it is. But for those few minutes, you forget about all that. And you're entertained. You're captivated by what's going on. You might be learning something new. And right there and then, I'm like, I'm, I'm doing something more than just creating content. I'm actually helping others out. I'm, I'm clearing your mind. And that's what I was looking for that day. And I, I couldn't get that. And it, it, it stuck with me, it sunk in with me for the next few days. And I'm like, I'm trying to, trying to decipher how I'm gonna be doing this video to explain to you guys why I do this. All the reasons why I do this. And it, it, it all comes down to you guys, obviously, because if you guys didn't watch, I wouldn't make videos, right? I, I just wouldn't do it. You guys are entertained by what I do. You guys like it. Some people don't. I'm cool with that as well. I always tell people anytime you're watching my content, if you like it, cool. If you don't, also cool. I'm, I'm cool with that. You're not going to like everything. You and I are not going to have the same taste. I, I wanted to get that off my chest. I wanted to vent that out to you guys. I wanted to also thank you guys for always supporting, for always watching, because you have made this small, big channel <laughs> into something big for me um and you have made this into something um so thank you uh i i don't see myself stopping anytime soon i feel more hungrier than ever i feel motivated i have plenty of ideas of what i want to do there's plenty of content different content as well um so you don't have to be worried about that on that end <laughs> i know sometimes people run out of content and they you know, either they get repetitive or they just, the content doesn't go anywhere, you know? And I'm not throwing shit at anybody. I'm just, that, that, that's what it is. Sometimes I, I'm watching channels and and it, I'm like, whoa, like what happened? And I don't necessarily watch too many motorcycle content. I don't. I mainly watch a lot of current events, which, and hence the reason why I, all that stuff was coming up on my feed last week is because most of my stuff that I watch are current events. So maybe that has to do with it as well. But I watch a lot of car content, mostly. I watch a lot of history stuff, mainly. So current event, history, cars. Um, yeah, that, that's, that's what my channel consists of, of, with the stuff that I watch. Um, anyways, I, I would love to hear your feedback on this, guys. I'm sorry, I know this was a deep, deep, deep dive into <laughs> into this video um we got a little personal today um i want to hear your take on this your feedback um i want to know what else you watch who else you watch what helps you get through those tough days at times where you maybe you're having a bad day for whatever reason it is uh, uh what do you look for um and then what's one of the main reasons why you watch my channel if you can answer that for me that that'll be great appreciate that like this video comment share with your friends and uh that's it man i'm gonna keep enjoying this beautiful evening here in jersey thank you guys for watching like always let the force be with you ride safe and enjoy the ride baby peace